Moving on now, the United States government has inadvertently revealed the details of a top secret Israeli military base. U.S. Department of Defense projects, uh, projects are typically made public for bidding by contractors, and the Obama administration had already promised to build Israel a new missile base. The $25 million facility was detailed online in more than 1,000 pages of specifications, revealing its approximate location and details such as the thickness of its walls. The Pentagon has so far refused to comment, but U.S. media reports say Israeli military officials are furious that the base's details are made public. Let's go to Atlanta and talk to Jim W. Dean, Managing Ed Editor of Veterans Today. Welcome to the program. So, Mr. Dean, the release of such classified documents, uh, and for that matter, Washington's closest ally, Israel, I mean, just how accidental or deliberate, if you may, could this be? Well, it uh, wouldn't be the first time that the accountants and administrative people, uh, the left hand didn't know what the right hand was doing. But uh, from what we've heard, that when these things have to be put out for bid, uh, they have to be put out to bid to anyone that wants to uh, bid on them. So uh, this was a regular routine, but somebody, I guess, should have gone through the contract and uh, uh, redacted some of it, which they didn't. But that's just the beginning of the problem, because the Americans, what they're now getting, uh, this has been a huge, huge ongoing scandal below the radar, are the facilities that American taxpayers have been building in Israel to protect their top staff in case they go to war and somebody wants to retaliate against them from a strike that they make, which puts Israel in a situation of not really feeling that they need to negotiate because they have not only a military superiority, but they have Uncle Sam basically uh, uh, being a blank check and the U.S. taxpayers are uh, oxen tied to the wagon, uh, which they can pull uh, any way they want to. Indeed, and, and with, with this, this declassification, what impact would this have on Israel's security as a whole, something that Washington always brags about? Well, they're really kind of uh, uh, making this up with satellites now. Uh, you know where all of these facilities are. Uh, spy satellites with hyperspectral radar uh, can go beneath the ground and even seeing uh, even what all the underground facilities are. So certainly they would be targeted. But the real scandal is Americans, for instance, don't even realize that the Army Corps of Engineers has actually gone over to Israel and built huge uh, construction projects, uh, part of the wall around uh, Gaza, and other products, projects that American people would be appalled at. But it's buried in the Army budget, and the American people have been constantly deceived in how we undermine uh, the peace process in Israel by maintaining their complete military superiority so they don't have any reason to make peace. Indeed. Well, we'll leave it there for the timing. Many thanks sir, to Jim W. D., Managing Editor of Veterans Today from Atlanta. Thanks for your time there, sir.